Thursday. So this is the hair all fixed. If y'all can see the back. Anyway, I love it. I wasn't really sure yesterday, but I love it. Um, I really like it short. So that's the hair. Now I'm going to show y'all the wall part I was talking about yesterday about where I want to put the ladder that I repurpose the baby bed. And then I'm also going to show you the print that I'm looking for a frame for, for Christmas. So let's go over to the dining room. Okay. This is the part of the wall that I want to put a ladder across. Um, and I'm going to take that fork down because I broke the spoon. So I'm, I don't know what I'm going to do there, but what do y'all think? Don't y'all think that would be cute? Let me get kind of get where that light's on the way. If I had like a little ladder kind of going across here, not the full span of the wall by any means, but you know, start about a little past the picture and go maybe to where that fork is at, something like that. I don't know, I'm just thinking out loud. So that was my idea where I wanted to put the ladder because you can see, I mean, there's so much space. And I even thought about making a like shelf out of it and maybe I could set some stuff up there. I don't know, so I'm just playing with those ideas. Now I wanna show you the print that I bought from the thrift store last year. Okay, this is the print I bought from the thrift store last year. It was $6.99. And see how it's like a canvas, but it does have like paint strokes. I thought it was really beautiful. I love it. But I wanna get an old vintage frame to go around it and use it. And I think that would really like make it pop. So guess where you girls fixing to go? Mm-hmm. You guessed it. So, I'm fixing to go to the thrift store. And no, I do not have on my lucky outfit. Um, I'm going to chance it without it. We'll see. Um, but I'm going to run at the thrift store. And I never did go to Walmart yesterday. Because it took so much time with my hair. And, and then doing her hair and all that. So, I didn't get a chance to go to Walmart. So, I've got to go pick up some things from Walmart. So, and it looks like it's fixing to storm. <laughs> Yay. Um... Hot muggy day today. Don't feel like fall. What else is new? Welcome to South Mississippi. So let's get to the thrift store. But I wanted to show y'all, look at that cloud out there. I won't focus, there we go. Look at that, oh my gosh. Ugh. Anyway, obviously it's not gonna stop me from thrifting. <laughs> I wanna go, cause I wanna measure that canvas so I can get, um, try to find a frame for it and um, to see what they have, so. Yep, let's go. Just like that, the sun is shining, it's raining. And I've always heard when the sun's shining and it's raining, that means the devil's beating his wife. <laughs> y'all heard that before? I'm sure y'all have. So I've got to go get some gas real quick. And um, it's hot. It is so stinking hot. I'm so over hot. Hot, hot, hot. It needs to go away. It's your dish, trust me. So I will link that video down below for y'all if y'all haven't seen it. And um, it might be something you wanna try. It's really, really good. We love it. And it's easy, you know, it's an easy dish. One dish, you have everything in it. And um, it's so easy. Everybody usually loves it. And um, so, yeah. So I'm gonna get to pick up the stuff for that too. So let me get some gas. And then we're gonna head to the thrift store. Whoop whoop! So excited! I think that uh, I'm gonna go to my favorite one first, and then I'm gonna try the Goodwill. Y'all know how I feel about the Goodwill, but I'm gonna try it because you never know. You just never know my, what might have been brought in over the weekend, and they might actually have a nice price on it. So we'll see. Touch base with you just a little bit. Y'all, I have got to quit watching these thrifting videos. 
they just get me in the mood to thrift like crazy i have been watching um several new channels i found that i really like uh i can't remember the names of them right off i'll try to put them down here somewhere but this one is it the thrifted thriller or thriller thrifted something like that i don't know she's awesome i love i love her videos she just finds the most amazing things at her thrift stores and i just love them but i'll be watching her videos at night and oh, i'm like oh i need to go thrift it so then i get up the next day and go th thrifted she is bad for me <laughs> i need to quit watching <laughs> but um I highly recommend her channel if you like thrifting and um, if you go over there and follow her, let her know that I sent you. I don't even know if she knows who I am. Um, I just found her channel and um, I like passing on different channels um, that I like in case y'all have not heard of them and like them. Um, and it's kind of like stuff like that I like so anyway thought I'd share that with y'all I really like her and um, she has some great thrifting videos um, also Crate Myrtle Row she does thrift hauls she her whole house is basically decorated in thrifted items and she finds amazing things. I love to watch her thrifting videos. I love to watch her videos. She's really sweet. Um, so if you like thrifted, vintage, stuff like that, you would definitely love her channel as well. So um, shout out to Lisa. Um, she does, she, I don't know how, she just finds the best stuff. <laughs> And I'm like, what am I doing wrong? Y'all need to share your tricks with me because I'm obviously doing something wrong. <laughs> but anyway, I will list all of the channels that I've mentioned in the description box below. Um, the other channel that I like is Homemade Vintage. She does um, thrifting videos and she does decor with thrifted items and stuff. And I really like hers too. So, um, just some options for y'all. I will link their video, their channels in the description box below. And if y'all love thrifting, all things thrifting, you would definitely enjoy, I think you will definitely enjoy their videos because I, I do. And that's kind of, you know, kind of the types of stuff I like. So just thought I would share that with y'all. Now I've gassed up. Oh my gosh, I'm so sick of these gas prices. I know I'm not the only one. Um, it's just like, man, they need to just stop. But now that I've gassed up, I did call James. He's all good with the hamburger casserole for dinner. So I'm gonna go to the thrift stores and then run to Walmart. And I would order it and have it delivered, except I need to do a little bit of shopping in there and looking around for some different things. I wanna look for Buster some different kinds of treats and um stuff like that so that's why i'm not doing the delivery but anyway i'll touch especially on just a little bit <laughs> well that was bust i only bought one thing well that don't include my honey buns i bought <laughs> my fuel so that store was very picked over today and then there was one there was several rude people in there like no common courtesy but we just love them anyway so I'm gonna eat my honey bun on the way to the Goodwill and hopefully I can find a frame there I just need 11 by 14 so I had um there was one good option there but it was 8 by 10 so that ain't no work so on to the goodwill oh my gosh I have got to tell y'all what just happened to me for the very first time ever I went into the goodwill and 
this beautiful lady walked up to me and she was like, you have a YouTube channel? I said, yes, ma'am. She says, I follow you. I met a subscriber today. It was so wonderful. She's beautiful. I'm going to insert her picture. Her name is Carolyn. She is absolutely gorgeous and so sweet and just made my day made my day so thank you for coming up to me and introducing yourself i loved it i almost cried <laughs> i almost cried but um that was so cool i have never had that happen before and today has been made i did not find a frame at goodwill so the hunt continues and I'm not going to the other thrift store because their prices on frames are just ridiculous so I'm just I'm not even gonna do it so now I'm gonna head to Walmart to get what I need to get for dinner tonight and then when I get home I will show you the things I bought at the thrift stores it's very very tiny tiny haul but I will show you so that's it but that was just my day has been made that was awesome just awesome i loved it so eee, puts me on cloud nine all right y'all touch base with y'all just a little bit all right are y'all ready for this massive thrift haul that i've got um at the first thrift store the american thrift store i picked up this it's a little shelf kind of thing and i originally purchased it because i thought about putting it up there to kind of elevate um, some decor up there, but then on further thinking about it, I think I'm going to put it on top of the black shelf that James made me because I have so much stuff trying to elevate all that. And I think this would be the perfect width and it would go up there, but either it's going to be one of these two places and I paid $1.99 for it, which I didn't think was bad at all. And it's metal. So I'm just going to clean it up and use it and I'll show you what I do with it. And then at the Goodwill, I picked up two more wooden spoons. This one was 59 cents. And it looks like it was on sale. They discounted 29 cents, so I got it for 30 cents. And then this one, which is a little bit thicker, was 99 cents, and it wasn't on sale. So it's got this, but I don't really care because I'm gonna have it down in my crock like that. But I'm um, gonna wash these up and um, add them to my wooden spoon collection. And that's all I got for my thrift haul. Um, I mean, not a bad day. Plus I got to meet sweet Carolyn, but um, I really, really wanted a frame, but that's okay. I didn't wear my lucky outfit, y'all. I needed my lucky outfit on. That just proves it right there. Today proved it. Well, I don't know. I was kind of lucky I met Carolyn, but I didn't, wasn't, I didn't get as much things, get as many things. So I guess this proves that I've got to wear my lucky thrift outfit. So got all my stuff from Walmart, got everything I needed there. And it is so hot, y'all. I'm sweating so bad. It's fixing to storm again. Um, but at least I don't have to water the flowers because the Lord is watering the flowers. So let me get this little shelf cleaned up and let's try to figure out where I'm gonna put it. So let me get that cleaned up and I'll be right back. Okay, so I had to put it, I had to put it here because it would not work up there. Um, so I just did away with that idea up there and I put it up here. And of course these chickens are not gonna stay here. It's just until I can get my bookcase done. But you know, this might even be something I use on my bookcases to elevate, so. Yep, that's that. I've washed up my spoons. They're all nice and clean. Gonna let them dry and get them over there in my crock. And it is storming outside. Storming. So. Fun times, y'all. Fun time. So now I guess I'm going to go put my sheets in. Oh, I've already put them in the dryer. So I'm going to go put my sheets on my bed, make my bed up, and that'll be done. And then I'll start cooking my casserole in, in a couple hours because I like to cook it and let it like really marinate the flavors. 
So I'll do that in a little bit. And until then, I don't know. We'll see. I did pick this up today at Walmart, this uh, farm apple and pumpkin. It smelled really good. This was like $2. So I've just turned off all my wax warmers. I'm gonna get the old wax out and then put these in and try these. Um, so it smelled really good. So we'll see what it smells like when it warms up. I mean, I wish there was smell-o-vision, but y'all just have to take my word for it. I go to the store and smell it for yourself. I love it. It smelled really good. Well, just had dinner. The casserole turned out great. It has rained here pretty much all day, and now it's so nice and cool. So that's going to do it for me today. Um, I think tomorrow I'm going to go to a different thrift store. There's one in Gulfport that's opened up and I want to go to it. So we may do that tomorrow. I don't know. Um, James is working half a day tomorrow, so I really don't know what's going to happen. But if I do something like that, I'll bring you along. So I hope you have a great day. Bye, y'all. Mm -hmm.